Hello, fellow travelers. This is Alan Paul here again at No Man's Sky. Hello there, Mr. Geck, or walking through my scene. And you're just going to sit there right in front of the camera, aren't you, there, oiler? Come on, get back to work. Gosh, can't pay these guys enough money to keep active. I swear to God. Anyway, let's move on. What we're doing today is we're going to, as you saw by the description of the video, we're going to do a little work with whispering eggs. Whispering eggs. Yes, whispering eggs. It doesn't seem like it's a big thing to really uh, focus on, but we're going to take a ride out of here and go find ourselves an abandoned place to get some whispering eggs. Why am I doing this? First of all, I need to change my ship. Uh, let's see. I think we're going to go... Ooh, should I go with the Freudian ship? Let's go with Freudian ship today. One of my favorites. And I love naming it the Freudian ship. It just play on words all the way, my friends. Anyway, let's go ahead and take the Freudian ship out of the docking bay of my death's head. And on we go to yet again another upside down freighter that is uh, kind of cool when it's like this. And my lovely flotilla of frigates. Thank you very much, fellas. So what are we going to do? We need to find, again, an abandoned place that has some whispering eggs. And I'm going to show you the best way that I feel is the best way, that is, to harvest the whispering eggs. So what we need to do is we need to find one first. So what are we going to do? First of all, let me just jump over to the exosuit real quick. I'm going to move this over to my starship because it's easier to use it in there. And where'd they go? Over here. Okay, great. Planetary charts. You're going to look for the ones that have the little bullseye on them because you're looking for something that's a distress signal. But you're not always going to find what you're looking for. So let's plot the route. Oh, first one it found is an abandoned building. So if you found a ship or something crashed, you can just mark it for later and you can try the next one. So let's see. Abandoned building right there. Let's go ahead and head out there. It's on a really ugly planet here. I have five planets in the system. Three of them are paradise planets. But I swear to you, it always finds this stuff on the worst planet in the system. So, you know, whatever. It's a tectonic planet which means it's got volcanic eruptions and it's very very hot but it's okay I mean we got the shields for it so I'm not too too concerned on it looks like a storm is actually happening right now so we find ourselves in an abandoned building that's the first step whoa and we try not to hit the ground when we come in okay all right we'll just park over here don't forget where where we parked everybody all righty now, I need to switch over. I don't want to use any of my guns. I'm just going to use a mining beam. Okay. Get my shield back up to snuff. Okay. Ah, this is a bigger one, too. This is good. This is good. All right, so what do we got? We got lots of these whispering egg things around here, and these things are worth a fortune, both in nanites and in credits. I usually prefer to sell them for credits, but you can turn them into nanites, too, in a refiner. But they're always, everybody has all kinds of different methods for trying to get these. Um, I used to stand up top, face one direction, take out an egg, and then jump on the other side and try to gather them. But the Hello Games uh, programmers decided to make that not work anymore. Because rather than having all, all the uh, creatures pop up on one side of the facility, now they pop up all over the place. And we're back to square one. So I gave this a shot one day, and I found that you just got to keep moving. They really they hurt very, very little especially in normal mode, they hurt very little. And even if they do hit you, it, you usually don't go far. So just keep moving. And that's all you have to do. So that's the key. Let's get one of the eggs and I'll show you what happens. So here they are. They're all popping out of the ground. Just move around. Pick out the next one. Pick it up. Keep moving. You can stop for a moment. They're not going to hurt you. See, they're still busy trying to reorient themselves every time you change a direction. There's some eggs over here. I'm going to go ahead and skip those two because I can't see them. Uh, there's probably eggs right here. Yeah, I can see them right there right now. There, see? How many times have I been hit, folks? I just picked up a whole bunch of eggs. Okay, just keep moving. And that's the key to this. And they'll, they'll hit you once in a while. It's not going to hurt you. It's not Well, it'll hurt you, but it's not going to kill you. See, I literally walk right in front of that guy. Whoops, see that? How much damage did I take? There's an egg in here someplace. There we go. 
See? Look at that. Did I get that one? Oh, there was one there. Cool. Now, every now and then, if one does hit you pretty hard, it'll knock you for a loop, but... He, he just... He just hit me. The spitting hurts more. Yep, see, that one didn't drop one. See, I just got hit again. What's happened to me? Nothing. Just got hit again. He just spit at me. But because I kept moving, he didn't get me. And I'm going to skip to the other side here real quick. There we go. Look at that. What a fortune I'm making right now, All right, That one's now empty. I don't have to go to that patch anymore. And there's nothing there, so we're done with that patch. Whoopsie. Look at that. How much damage did I take? None. Okay. And they're just zipping all over the place. They literally can't keep up with you. Okay, got another one. Try to find a place that you can see these eggs a little better, folks. I can't even see them anymore. Too much foliage. I'm going to stay put. I'm curious. All right, I took damage there. How much damage did I take? See? Not that bad. Oh, there was one there. Oh, hello? Okay. That was really weird. Okay. And just keep going. This one's clear. How many have I gotten? Have I, I've lost count of how many I've picked up. Hi, guys. Excuse me. Just going to pass through over here. There we go. Any over here? I don't even know anymore. I think I'm hitting plants. Yeah, all right, Dust. Look at that. Yeah, I don't think there's any more over there. Whoop. And he literally knocked me into the building. So if you can't take enough, just go inside. Hey. Hey, that's rude. Stop spitting. Didn't your mommy teach you manners? Come on. No spitting at the dinner table. Especially with potential food. Alright, so I'm going to head inside for now. Okay, good deal. Let's see what our take was. Uh, that's my starship. Uh, let's see. Uh, my inventory is a little disorganized. 10, 20, 22 of the larval cores. And how much are they worth? 700,000 apiece for each stack. So I literally walked away with, uh, let's see, 7, 14, uh, 15, a little over 15, 1.5 million. And that didn't take me long at all. So that gives you, yeah, that's that's hilarious. So that gives you a rough idea of how you can get this done. And then after a little bit, the swarm subsides, you head back to your ship, and Bob's your uncle, as they say. And there you go. See? All done. And I think we cleared out all the eggs from this one. There might have been one or two more, and I might have missed one or two, but that eh, is what it is. And uh, yeah, we got a little bit of an overachiever over here. Anyway, all right. But that, in a nutshell, is that. Um, so as you can see, really wasn't that difficult to do. And I didn't get panicked. I didn't go running around screaming. I'm not crying right now. I can promise you. Not crying. I'm doing pretty well. So why don't we give you a good old-fashioned, even though it looks more like they're peering into the distance, I'm going to give you all a salute right now. And thank you very much for watching. We appreciate your being here. And uh, hey, I hope you enjoyed the video. Hit that like button. And by all means, subscribe. I've got a lot more videos coming up. Uh, i got so many ideas, so many different things I want to do here with No Man's Sky. Again, if in case you haven't watched me before, I've, I've been playing for about three years now, and I've got over 1,900 hours of playtime in this game. Really enjoy it, and I'm learning something new every single time. And, uh, you know, if you wonder why I play it all the time, it's because of the exploration purposes of it. It's because I love to talk to other people about it. I love to teach you about it and everything that you can possibly do with such a game to just, you know... Uh, give yourself a relaxing, relaxing type of uh, game to play. This really is enjoyable, especially if you... Uh, let's put it this way. If you've played Minecraft in the past, I look at this as more being like Minecraft for adults. It's really way up there. But I still play Minecraft. 
Okay. Thank you very much again for watching, folks, and we'll see you again in our next video. Take care, everybody.